Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Now we'll start this course from the beginning. So we'll start with some basic vocabulary, okay? So here you okay, have, okay. you see the pictures. I will read the word and you will repeat after me, okay? Batta. Batta. Baid. Baid. Bakara. 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 Miss Ba Miss Ba Hobbs Hubbel Hubbel Kalb Kalb Maktab Maktab Enab Enab Bab Bab Dub Dub Kitab Kita. Okay, now kindly tell me your name and your age. My name is Ayan. My name is Ayan. My name is Your name is Ayan, and what is your age? My age is nine. Okay, you are nine years old. Good. And what about others? My name is Latifa. I am twelve. Twelve years old. Okay. So you both. Okay. Latifa, read this word and also tell me its name in English. Batta, duck, baid, egg. Good. Bakara, cow. Misbah, bulb. Or you okay? Cooks, bread. Hubble, Hubble, rope, Kalb, dog, Maktab, table, Inab, grape, Bab, door, Duk, bear, Kitab, book. Good. Rian, now you will read and you will tell me the name. Yes. Butta, duck, baid, egg, buck, ra, cow, misba, bull, coops, bed, hubble, rope. Kalb, dog, maktab, table, inab, gifts, bab, door, dub, bear, kitab, book. Good. So the key to learning in Arabic is to learn the Arabic vocabulary. So you need to memorize all these words with the meaning, okay? This is very important thing. So this is your homework. You will memorize all these words with the meaning, okay? Okay. Now repeat after me. Haza. Haza. Haza means this. What is the meaning of haza? Haza means this. This. And the word haza is used only for masculine things. Haza is used only for masculine things. Good. Haza khubs. Haza khubs. Haza kalb. Haza kalb. Now we have the word hazihi. Hazihi also means this. this. But it is used for feminine words only. Hazi is used only for feminine words, and Haza is used only for masculine words. Masculine words, good. Hazi he batta. Hazi he batta. Hazi he bakara. Hazi he bakara. Good. Latifa, read. And translate. 
Haza means this in masculine words. Haza kubro, kubs. Haza kubs. This is bread. Haza kalb. This is dog. Hazihi. This in feminine words. Hazihi batta. This is duck. Hazihi bakara. This is cow. Okay. Now, Ryan. Haza means this. It's feminine word. It's masculine. It's masculine. Masculine word. Haza hoops. This is bed. Haza kalb. This is dog. Hazi he. This hazi means this is feminine word. Feminine Hazi he. But has he but uh, this is duck has he, he bakra this is cow good so in on this page we have learned two more words haza and has he you need to memorize these two words also okay what silly kalima bisora what sil mean connect or it also mean join Join oh, the word. Match. Okay, you yeah. can say match. Good. So match the word. Al kalima mean the word. Bisura with the picture. Match the word with the picture. Join the word with the picture or connect the word with the picture. So we need to join them together. Okay. Bisba. So you will tell me with which word should I join? Bisba. This but third one. Third what one. Very good. Bulk. So you will join Miss Bavin Bulk. Bubble. Next. Third. Miss Bavin. Okay, next. Miss Bavin Bulk. Miss Bavin third picture. Okay, now tell me about this picture. With which word should I join this picture? Bakara. Bakara. First picture. Next. Yes. Yes. Next picture. But but the duck duck. Oh, good. Next. Kitab last word. Last last picture. Kitab is last picture, and this one. Kubs. Kubs. Good. So in this way we join them. This time he's asking us to complete the missing letter. Harf mean letter alphabet and nakis mean missing. Akmil mean complete. Complete the missing letter. So we need to complete the word with the help of the picture. Ba. 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 Okay. So we write here. Ba. Good. Ba. Next. Ba. In a, in a, in a, in a, in a, in a, ba. Ba. Next. Baid. 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 Next. Maktab. Good. Next. Ba. Ba. Habal. Habal. Good. Next. Ba. 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 So in this way we do it. Then sahi au khata. Correct or wrong. So you know that haza is used for masculine and hazi is used for feminine. Any yes. word, any word which mm -hmm. has this round ta is considered as feminine word. Okay. Okay. Any, any word which has this round ta, this round ta is known as ta marbuta. So any word which has ta marbuta at the end is considered as feminine word. So. Mm -hmm. For masculine words, if haza is written, then this, this means the sentence is correct. And 
if has if has is written for masculine word then this means sentence is wrong so so latifa read and translate this sentence and tell me whether it is correct or wrong has a khubz this is bread it's correct correct okay next has he bakara this is ka correct correct so for correct you can say sahi in arabic okay sahi <laughs> okay next. next as a kalb this is a bear this is dog 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 kata kata what is the meaning of kalb dog dog correct then hazihi batta correct correct this is a duck good has a kitab this is book khata correct so in this way we do this question now riyan has a khubz this is bed sahi has a bakra this is cow sahi has a kal this is dog khat khata ha very good has the patta sahi has a kitab this is book khata yes okay so in this way we do this one then we have istami wa ashri la sura listen and point to the picture so basically i will say a word in arabic and you will tell me which picture is this okay okay so latifa baid yes baid egg the last last As, uh, the third picture then habal habal is first one rope okay bab second one door riyan yes khubz khubz bed the first one kitab kitab the second one bab bab the second one good istami wa ashri al kalima listen and point to the word i will say a word and you will tell me it's arabic latifa yes bread khubz the second one cow third one bakara beer dub second one good riyan book khubz the last one okay what is yes. the arabic for this word books or book books tab kitab book mean kitab okay then egg egg bait good first one duck third one good duck kawin kalima make the word so letters are written they here we will just join them and they will become a word so read them and tell them the meaning mak mak tab mak tab meaning uh table very good next kal 
Kalb meaning dog. Good. Next. Bab door. Good. Next. Anab. Inab. 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 Next. Bata. What is inab? Caps. Grapes. Say grapes. Okay. And what is batta? Buck. Uh, it is a uh, duck. Duck. Rian. Yes. Now you will make the word. Mucked up. Good. Table. Make. Good. Table. Next. Kalp. Meaning? Kalp. Dog. Very good. Bab. Means door. Good. Anab means grape. Grape, okay. But the means but the means duck. Duck. Ikhtaril kalimata sahiya. Choose the correct word. We have three words here. One of them is correct. So tell me which word is correct. Second one. Okay. What is it? Duck. Okay. Next. Miss Ba. The third one. Correct. Meaning? Miss Ba. Bulb. 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 Next. Uh, Hubble. Meaning? Rope. 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 Next. Inab. The second one. Okay. Grapes. Grapes. Rian. Yes. Which word is correct? Second one. Second one. Really? But uh, meaning duck. Okay, next. Miss Ba, third one. Meaning bulb. Next. Two. Second one. Okay. Hubble. Dog. Rope. Next. Second one. Enough. Second one. Good. Meaning? Yeah. Great. Grapes. <clears throat> Next, she's asking you to practice the writing for these words. You can do it or you can skip it, no problem. So, Today I am going to keep this class short at it is your first class. So now you can rest. So memorize the vocabulary, then write the words on your notebook and write their meanings without taking help from any dictionary or anything else. Okay. First memorize their meaning and then write them on your notebook and send me whatever vocabulary we have learned today. Okay. Do you have any question? Um, Sheikh, uh, when you take uh, every day classes, uh, how many days? It is up to you. You can take, you, you will just book the appointment uh, before every class. Okay, uh, in a week, three days? It is up to you. You can take three classes or whatever you want. No problem. Whatever okay, is, three classes. Whatever is uh, comfortable for the children. Yeah, okay. no three classes at the same time this time. Yes, you can if you want to take. Are you comfortable with this time? No. I have no issue, but it will be okay. better if you make the appointment before every class. Okay. 
Okay. So I uh, so recommend you to make the appointment for the next class. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So so sun, Sunday. Yes, you can take class on Saturday, Sunday. We don't fix any holiday. Yeah. Children, student, decide it yourself. Alternate day, Sunday, uh, Tuesday. Sunday, alternate days. Sunday, Tuesday, and uh, Thursday, right? Right. Okay, no problem. Sunday, th Tuesday, and uh, Thursday. Okay, no problem. <clears throat> this Sunday, I will be a little busy, but uh, normally I am free at Sunday. Okay. Okay, no, no issue. Yeah, so, yeah. So you better make the appointment for the next class. Yeah. So appointment uh, from WhatsApp, right? Yes, appointment from the link that I sent. Okay. okay. Any question? No, no question. Okay. So ask them to memorize the vocabulary and then send me after writing it on their notebooks. One more question actually uh, for the group, uh, you can tell female groups the same uh, subject you are teach or uh, that one, the Lugatul Arabia. In the group book. class, all are uh, adults, so I will teach them different book. This book is for yeah. children only, so I have decided okay. this book for them. Okay, no problem. Okay. Ma salama. 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 Ma salama.